is I want to talk about um, uh, Antonio Brown. Brown. They just released him from the Patriots. All I got to say is, guys, y'all better watch your songs. Because you you get you get fired from your job just because somebody says something now. They don't even have to prove nothing. So they can just be mad with your child for anything. I have sons. I do not want. I'm a, I'm I'm just training them right now. That's all I want to say about this. But y'all better watch your sons, bro. Them chicks out here mad with you. Before I, I'm not saying if he did it, he shouldn't be he shouldn't be in trouble or whatever they're gonna do with him. But I'm saying I'm one of them type of people. I need I need to see some proof that I actually he did something or this and that. Text messages, him trying to, him not being a criminal lawyer. He don't know nothing about nothing. That, them texts, they were saying something about the text said um, he was trying to find, get somebody to uh, investigate the chick or whatever. It was more of an investigate her because she trying to, you know, do whatever. He, he, It was just stupid stuff. I feel like it was just, they piling on. They trying to get rid of him. They trying to uh, gotcha sucker to him because he was winning, getting all that money out of him. And he was, you know, beating the system. So, he, they was like, oh, okay, we got you. We got you. So, I was just waiting to see what this do. And I'm going to be sitting around waiting and see if, if, if she can prove anything. Or is, if, if this lawsuit is going to go away. Or is he going to settle. Or what's going to Just be, keep watching and check out the results. Um, so, we can see what happens with this case. But I feel like, um, at this point... Like, you can even just get accused and be screwed out of your job. Like, y'all better be careful out here in these streets, dudes. For real. Y'all better be careful. Watch these chicks. Watch them. Because guess what? They can just, you can be mad. Y'all won't be with them no more. And they get all mad and out, bent out of shape and just accuse you of anything. And I'm not saying he's innocent. And I'm not, my point is, he, I don't feel, I'm, I'm like, let's prove something first, then deal with him. That's how I look at it. I'm not saying don't punish him. Just, Prove. I'm not talking about no text messages. I'm not talking about all this old stuff these women be collecting on dudes when they mad about some dudes be doing a kind of outbursts and doing stupid stuff all the time. I didn't got cussed out a many times, like I said before. I, I didn't got cussed out a lot of time too, all kind of stuff. But see them the next day to pick up children or whatever, and they be like, "Hey, how you doing?" See, so nobody, I don't be paying attention to none of that stuff. Prove it. Prove it first and then deal with him accordingly. That's how I feel like. If he was screw, if he did this, then fire his butt or whatever. But I still don't feel like a lot of this stuff is warrants somebody to lose their job. If he get a criminal charge, duh, he gonna lose his job because if he go to jail for it. So that all goes together. If somebody just getting accused of stuff, they don't have no criminal charges. I don't feel like a dude that's not sitting out here committing crimes should be losing their job if he ain't, you know, in no criminal situation. So it just kind of seemed like one side of a lot of these dudes out here doing stuff. Some some dudes don't get in trouble, but then some dudes do. So just be mindful of your children out here, bro. Watch your sons, please. That's all I got to say. Have a great day. See you next time.